ஹாய் எவ்ரி ஒன் வெல்கம் பேக் டு அவர் சேனல் லக்ஷ்மிஸ் ஒன் ஸ்டா ஐ டிட் திஸ் டேக் ஓர் ஃபார் மை கசின்ஸ் ஹவுஸ் வார்மிங் செரிமனி இட் இஸ் வெரி பட்ஜெட் ஃப்ரெண்ட்லி ஆஸ் ஐ ஹாவ் யூஸ்ட் மோஸ்ட் ஆஃப் த ஐட்டம்ஸ் ஃப்ரம் டாலர் ட்ரீ அண்ட் ஃப்ரம் மைக்கல்ஸ் ஸோ லெட்ஸ் கெட் ஸ்டார்டட் ஹவு டு டூ திஸ் here i have drawn the pichwai cow and i have learned this pichwai cow painting from youtube only there are so many videos available on how to draw pichwai cow painting main has to draw the outline of the cow then the remaining will come automatically if you are not comfortable with drawing take a print out for me it took about 5 to 6 hours to draw the outline of the cow and the remaining will come automatically Once I am done with the drawing here I am copying the drawing to the white cardstock paper by using carbon sheet Once we are done copying the outline of the cow image here I am using acrylic marker some of the markers I am using here are fine tip and some are broad tip The materials which I am using here, I will be providing all the links in the description box. I have taken these broad tip and fine tip markers from Amazon. Here I don't have blue color marker so I am using here acrylic paint. If you are comfortable with the painting with zero brush, you can do painting also instead of using markers, whichever is comfortable to you. Once we are done with the painting, here I am using gift tissue paper to make the flower shape. Follow the instructions as I have shown in the video. I have used this method before also. Here I am taking about 7 inches flower. Draw like this and cut out. You can get a flower shape. Here I am using this flower cut out as the reference for cutting the flower shape on the red poster sheet as well as on the poster board also. The poster sheets and poster boards which I am using here I have taken from Dollar Tree. Remember now Dollar Tree everything is $1.25. You can get these poster sheets in Michaels for $1 also. So now from now on if you are buying for poster sheets is better to go with michaels you can get in dollar only Now attach the flower to the poster board. Remember that there should not be any bubbles while attaching the poster sheet to the poster board or else the bubbles will come up. Here I have painted red color on the borders also so that the white color will not show up while hanging to the backdrop. Sometimes the poster boards after applying the glue or after painting them it will lose its shape. It will start to bend inwards or outwards. Here I am adding these skewers so that it will not bend. Here I am adding double sided tape also so that it will stick to the backdrop it will not move while hanging. Now cut the cow image and stick it to the flower shape. If you are new to my channel please check out my other videos if you like them please give a like and don't forget to subscribe. Here for making the dots you can use back of the pencil or any object that is circular at the edge. If you don't want to do these paint dots in place of this one we can add stone stickers also or any crystal stickers which is in circular. These are available in Dollar Tree, Michaels everywhere or in Amazon also.
like this i have made totally six cutouts three right facing and three left facing here for making the left facing cow image i have turned the page which i have done the drawing and traced the image so that i can get a left facing you can also try this technique For making Ganesha, I have already posted a detailed video on how to make a DIY tracing paper and how to trace the image using TV. If you are good at drawing, we can draw the image and we can cut it out on the poster board. Here I am going for red color so I have painted the red color. For making the flower shape, I am using here 1 inch circles of the gift tissue paper. Once we are done cutting with all 1 inch circles, stick it to the poster board using the school glue here i'm using back of the pencil and twisting it a little bit and sticking it to the poster board try to do this activity with your kids they will like it a lot and our work will be done very quickly once i am done here also i have added the wood skewer so that it will not bend for hanging this Ganesha to the backdrop, here I am using this invisible thread so that it will not be seen to the backdrop. If invisible thread is not available, choose the color same as your backdrop so that it will not be seen. Here in the backdrop, I am using here the same technique which I have used before. By using the cable tie here, I have tied this cut and dot at the back of the backdrop stand. I have used this method in previous backdrops also. By adding this one, we can tie the garlands directly to the cut and rod instead of using safety pins to the backdrop cloth, whichever is comfortable. This method is comfortable to me, so I am going with this one. Here I am attaching these garlands to the cutouts by using tape. Like this, I am tying this garland to the cut and rod which I have hang it to the backdrop stand. The cut and rod which I am using here is about 8 feet wide. If you are inspired and want to try any one of my DIYs, please share your pics with me. And don't forget to follow me on my Instagram. It will be my pleasure to watch all your pics. If you are new to my channel, please subscribe and if you like this video, please give a like. See you all in my next video. Thank you.